probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. In order to escape, we're going to have to go through her chamber, and she will probably kill us if if she's um, awake. If you want to just call it quits, and we could just sit here forever, that's an option. <laughs> option A, sit here, do nothing. Option B, go through there, and if she's alive, she'll almost certainly kill us. So, if you've got any reservations whatsoever about this plan, now would be a tremendous time to voice them. <laughs> right now. All right. Hello, ladies and gents. I'm Put Zephyr yourself. Victorious. It's the window of time to voice my reservations. Still open. And <laughs> welcome to Portal 2. So this is where we left off in the last game with our snarky little companion here who can't seem to figure out what he wants to do. Um, and apparently we're going through her chamber. I don't know who her is. So... Um, yeah, let's see where we go. I mean, we can't really go back, so. And I can't talk, so I can't voice anything. Okay, I'm gonna lay my cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't, don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. On we go. Wow. Skittish much. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Like a proper maniac. Do you know who ended up, uh, do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? You're not gonna believe this. A human. I know, I know, I wouldn't have believed either. Apparently this human escaped and uh, nobody's seen him since. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where um, absolutely nothing happened. And then there's us escaping now, so um, that's pretty much the whole story, you're up to speed. <laughs> this is, that was the incineration chamber where I got her last time. So I'm not the same test subject then, because they haven't seen that test subject since. So I'm a new portal person. I have no idea where to go. Cause you can't really like climb any of this debris, can you? No. I love how he was like freaked out that she was gonna be on though, and like she's been dead for years. There's the arrows again, telling me where to go. Okay, down these stairs. No, really? I actually look at it. That is quite a, that's quite a distance, isn't it? To where? Okay, you know what? Uh, go ahead and jump. You've got you've got braces on your legs, so you're all set. Although no braces on your arms, though, so you're going to have to rely on the old human strength to keep a grip on the on the device and and by extension me. So do do really make sure you keep a grip on me. Also, a note: no braces on your spine either. So, so don't land on that um, or your head. No braces there. That could that could split like a melon from this height. <laughs> um, so, do definitely focus on landing with your legs. I really ah! want to know who this guy is. Oh, still held, still being held. You that's a great job. You've applied the grit. We're all fine. That's tremendous. Wow. I really want to know who does his voice, because he sounds really familiar, and it's hysterical. He's so ah, funny. I just, sorry, I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah, I've just done it again. I kind of want to make you look down now. Can I do it? Nope. Okay. Yeah, just stare at me with your freaky blue eye. I can't see where I'm going because of you, but that's all good, I suppose. This is the main breaker room. Let's oh. go in. Like most of Look the breakers have been flipped. That says escape pod. All right, don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't even, don't even look at anything else. Just well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something that doesn't say escape pod, look at something else. Look at the next thing. All right, but don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't. You understand? <laughs> Can you see it anywhere? Are you I kidding? Can't see it anywhere. Uh, what? I'll tell you what. Plug me in, and I'll turn the lights on. Let there be light. That's, uh, God. It's quoting God. Oh, look at that! Turning. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. Now. Escape pod, escape pod. It's, it's moving up. Okay. Okay, no, don't, don't worry. Don't oh, it's worry. flicking worry. everything. You slow it down. No. It's flicking up. everything. Uh-oh. Uh. Power up initiated. Okay, don't panic! Alright, so uh, panicking. Uh, I can, I can still... Uh. Um... Oh, there's a, there's a password. Okay, it's fine. I'll just, I'll just... Uh... No problem. A, 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 A... Uh... Uh... A, A, A... Hurry! A, A, C... Are you kidding? Start writing these down. Power up. Complete. I don't... Okay, 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 listen. Alright, new plan. Act natural, act natural. Nothing wrong. Hello! Oh. 
It's you. You know her? It's been a long time. Oh, I am the same one. How have you been? I've been really busy being dead. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? Ah! Uh, uh, no, 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 no! Ah! Uh, oh, no, 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 no! Uh, okay, look. We both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. But I think we can put no! our differences behind us. No! For science. No! For I will say, though, that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love to test. I love it, too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. Ah! No! <sighs> you killed him. I liked him. <sighs> you jerk. Aww. You trying to piss me off because you did a really good job. <laughs> why did we? Why did we do that? There was no point in that. Like that's really, really stupid. <sighs> we just woke her up, and she's gonna kill me. not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old time. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I'm totally gonna die. Uh... You have a dual portal device. There should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. No, I don't want to go back to the testing area. <sighs> I guess I have to though. Once testing starts, I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. On making me nervous. All good. All good. I can take whatever you can dish at me. Let me get that for you. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort of black box quick save feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. Oh shoot. I was able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, forever. You know, if you'd done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. I'm happy to put this all behind us and get back to work. After all, we've got a lot to do, and only 60 more years to do it. More or less. I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me. Oh dear. I'm in a lot of trouble now. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. And I have a murderous I'll just robot. Out of the way for you. This place really is a wreck. But the important thing is you're back with me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing for the rest of your life. After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. Oh god. <laughs> but she killed him. My little buddy. I don't even know what his name was. But I liked him. <gasps> I'm so sad. <laughs> <coughs> I'm so sad. Chapter 2, The Cold Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. 
Oh good, that's back online. I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test, which involves oh. deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Oh good. Goody, goody, goody. Well that is great, except um that means I have to get up there somehow. That um Oh, okay. If I get on there. And then I do that. Not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. Ugh. Am I gonna have to kill her again at the end of this? Because I don't want to do that. She was a pain. She was a pain in the butt. What is that? They just get used to this next having a laser in the discouragement work. redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your well, episode. Yeah, so I know we'll how to get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. Things <laughs> having a lot of trouble up there. Um, I probably can't just sit and watch that the whole time. Uh, where am I supposed to go? I think I just said, "What am I supposed to go?" But you know what I meant. This whole place is falling apart. How? Am I sp I, there should be a what in the corner? Oh. <gasps> was that him or was that her? Because I want it to be him. kind of can't. I feel like I'm supposed to be able to do this. But... Oh, I am a moron. I forget that I have portal gun. That I have a portal gun. Oh wait, what's this? What does this button do? What? Okay. Whoops. What does this do? Okay. Um. Ow. I jumped! Why is it not working? There we go. Man, y'all are just- those machine things are freaking out, dude. Uh, apparently I need to actually use these stairs. Who'd have guessed? Eh, crap. Do I need to get another one of those? I don't think I can without destroying that one, though, can I? Yeah, that one gets destroyed. 
which then means that the stairs are gone and that's stupid Ugh. sometimes the game makes me sick okay um, yeah so I can only do one of these things at a time Can I put this thing on there? Whoops. Alright, I'll try it in a sec. I need this first though. Yep. I wonder if this is heavy enough to set it on there. Thing. I seriously doubt that it is, but it's worth a shot. Dang it. Why am I so bad at stairs? Because I got no leg muscle. Well done. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. <laughs> That's what it says. A horrible person. Oh. We weren't even testing for that. Whoops. There we go. Logic. Huh. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Whoa! Hello. Okay. Um. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I've got a guess, but I don't know if it's correct. Actually, where's the thing supposed to be? There's one there, so if I put one here. Oh, there's one here. Uh, if I put it here and there. And here. Yeah, that one works. And then... I'm gonna need to put this one actually down there. Um, I don't know what that button did, but it was supposed to do something. Right? You think so? Uh, crap, no, I can't get back up there. Ah, frick. Bad idea. Bad idea, Seth. Okay. Um, that was a stupid idea as well. Good night. Okay. I gotta get this thing to work for that first. Simple enough. Okay. Then, I need to get up there. And do it for this thing here. Da -da, da -da. Congratulations. Not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. Oh, wow. Hey, you watch your mouth there, lady. I'll take you down again. I'll show you how packed on a few pounds I am. Like her. <laughs> I take you down. Watch me. I'm probably gonna have to either way, so let's get it out of the way now. <laughs> okay. One moment. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them, so feel free to slow down and 
Do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. I don't want to do that. Sorry. I like destroying stuff. It's fun. Oh good, what the heck am I supposed to do here? Um... Push a button! Oh, I got a cube! I know there's a button over there somewhere. Ah, uh, that's a blue. Let's do that. That was probably right next to where I was before. That's okay. Okay, so I need to get it over there. How? I need one of those thermo thingy cubes. Where is it? Oh no, I don't. Never mind. Oh shoot, I'm gonna be in the way for this. Yikes. Yeah. Okay. Shoot. I'm going to have to do this real quick. Get over here. And then... give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. Hey! You watch. I thought I did that one pretty quickly. Compared to the one that I did in Portal 1. <laughs> that took me 20 minutes to do. <laughs> I'm very, uh... I could not get that one. Hello. Thank you for clearing the way, I suppose. Um Stop doing that. Sorry. This next Timer's test involves screw. the Aperture Science Aerial Faceplate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. The results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. Huh? Are you kidding? I like the little new tiling over there, but what? Oh, shoot! Okay! Uh... This section looks new. Oh, crap. Do I have to go and catch it? Frick. I missed it. Why did the music get louder right there? Uh, okay, if I go right now. Boom. Got it! Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. Ah, oh, good for you. How? Okay, so we're far down? Like, how far down? And what kind of down are we talking? Are we talking like in the ground? Are we talking like from the equator? We t I guess you wouldn't have air. You would have air down by the equator. Never mind. Ignore Let's see me. what the next test is. I'm trying to be oh, a smart aleck. Advanced it's not aerial face plates. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to head the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. Sorry, that's what you get for being a brat. Are you kidding me? Where's that gonna go? It's gonna shoot me right into a wall! Huh? Oh, 
Oh crap, okay. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh, hey! I did something. <laughs> it was not what I meant to do, but I did something. What is this? It's just a can. A can of beans. What is that? Not that. That's a coffee cup. That's also a coffee cup. That's also a coffee cup. Can't pick that up. Okay. This is like a computer something. Smooth jazz fails. Nothing is real. Oh, so there are still... Uh, well, I mean, there were still survivors from the apocalyptic situation that I was in. Okay. Cool. Um, I am utterly confused, so... We're just gonna... I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going. So that's all good. Um, and I think I'm stuck now. No, I'm not. If I do that... That's something. Is it anything useful, though? Eh, useful-ish. That's something I can do. Oh, I can zoom. Oh, sorry. <gasps> I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. I can do that. Um, and then if I do this, like that. Boing. 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 Yay! I got a cube. And if I do that, and then do that. Oof. Look at me. I got this. And the button's clear over there. How am I supposed to do that? <laughs> what? Hmm. Could throw it. Oh, there we go. That works. Actually, no. If we do it down there. Actually, if we do it right here. <laughs> I'm smart, guys. Promise. Hey! Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. No, I got it. You made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Yeah, no, I, I got that. Thanks, though. Alright, I'm...